everyone, today we're here with Jonathan and we talk about education in the USA. Before we start, Jonathan came to Poland only a few days ago. Tell me, do you like it here? I do like it here. This is actually my second time in Poland. I came two years ago um, to the same town and I'm back again and I'm very excited to be here. How many years children go to school in America? So children go to school for 13 years. That's kindergarten and then first through 12th grade. Um, that's just your primary school. And then you can choose to go to college if you want to after that. Are schools free of charge or do you have to pay for them? So it depends on what type of school you go to. If you go to a private school, um, you do have to pay. And usually you wear a uniform and they have stricter rules. They don't follow the rules of the state necessarily. But if you go to a public school, which is the kind of school I went to, then it's usually free of charge. Um, you have to pay for lunch and sometimes different books, but that's about it. Do you have to study a lot in an American school? Yes, I studied a lot um, because my grades were very important to me. I've always wanted to um, be a doctor, so I knew that I needed to have the best grades in my class, so I studied a lot. Do you have school exit exams? Yes, so um, at a younger age you take um, state uh, mandated tests. Across the whole state, um, all the students take the same test, and it kind of lets you see how your school is doing compared to other schools. And then as you get older in high school, you take those tests and you also take um, tests in each individual class and you have to pass those to go on to the next grade. What does a typical prom look like? So I'd say my prom was pretty typical. Um, all of our teachers and a lot of parents worked together to decorate our cafeteria, which was pretty big. Um, and they have some kind of theme, so it might be like um, knights and princesses, or mine was Into the Woods. It was based on a play, so we had like trees, and um, the floor had like lots of plants on it. It was a lot of green, and everyone dresses up. Girls wear dresses, guys wear suits and tux, tuxes. Um, and you go with your date, you uh, take lots of pictures, eat food, some people dance, a lot of people just stand around, and it's kind of awkward. Uh, but it's, it was a lot of fun. My prom had a lot of games. You could play different games um, and win tickets, and then you might get to put your tickets toward getting a prize at the end of the night. What tests do you take to get into the university? So we have a couple of tests that we can take. One is the SAT and the other is the ACT. I took the ACT um, and the only difference is different schools accept one or the other, or they might accept both. And the schools in Arkansas often look at the ACT, so that was the test I took. Um, I had to go to a university in my hometown to take the test and it took four hours and was not fun, but I took it several times to try to get my score higher so that I could get scholarship money for university. So the ACT is only on Saturdays, so you have to take it outside of school, um, and you have to pay about $50 to take the test. But you can take it as many times as you want to try to increase your score, and the test has four different subjects. It's reading, math, science, and English. And so you can study for each subject and uh, try to do your best, and the scores are averaged together for one final score at the end. Do you pay money to attend university in the USA? Yes, uh, university in the USA is very expensive and most people cannot pay for it on their own so they apply for scholarships. And that's what I was mentioning earlier with the ACT, that's one way to get a scholarship. If you score well on the test, you can, they give you money to go to school because they see that you're a good student and that you're going to work hard to make good grades and become successful in whatever career you choose. So that's what I did. I, got a good score on my ACT and they helped pay for my university. Which school do you go to? I go to the University of Central Arkansas and it has that name because it's located in the center of Arkansas and it is a public university. How did you meet to your girlfriend? So it's actually kind of funny, my girlfriend is from Poland 
She was an international student that came to the U.S. her junior year of high school, so that's her third year of high school, and she stayed and she's going to university now. So we met at the University of Central Arkansas. We were both studying Spanish. Can you speak anything in Polish? I can say a few things like Dovezenia, uh, Seprasham, Dzień Dobry, Dziękuję, and that's about it. <laughs> can you say I love you? Uh, kocham? Kocham. 